Most people think this journey started a couple weeks ago, but it actually started a decade ago. We all share one passion, and that is storytelling. We are trying to tell the best story that we can with the equipment we have. When we started, we didn't have much, and obviously now we have more equipment, but the premise behind what we're doing is still the same. People will tell you along the way that you can't do it. When we quit our nine to five jobs, people thought we were idiots. But this judgment comes from people that you shouldn't care about anyways. And you should follow your passion and your goals. And that's what we're doing here. Is there still lots left to learn? Absolutely. But that fear of failure is not gonna stop us. We are Black House Cinema. What's up everyone, welcome to, today's welcome to today's video. But quickly, a message from our sponsor. Dude, we don't have any sponsors. Oh yeah. This is gonna be the application that will be in the bumpiest situations. Mm -hmm. So, we might as well. Yeah, we're trying to be extra safe versus just Hitting like the bare minimum. And it's and it's a pretty <laughs> evenly distributed load once we have it, because it'll be across three braces this way, tied directly into the pillar, and then tied across the entire thing also. What's up guys? Uh, so we just finished the first process, step one of getting the crane on the GX. Uh, we have all the speed rail and we hard mounted it into like the strongest part of the Sherpa roof rack that goes directly into the metal uh, frame in the roof. And uh, yeah, we'll just show you that quickly. All right, so we have the speed rail and then the speed rail clamps that we just custom mounted to the pillars of the roof rack. So it goes directly into like the strongest part of the roof. And yeah, super happy with it. Pretty clean look. Uh, we're gonna have three speed rails and then we're gonna run the crane on top uh, with two vertical posts uh, running lengthwise of the vehicle. So yeah, we'll just show you that process. But this was honestly the hardest part. So that's good that it was so easy. What's up guys, today we are headed to the uh, warehouse to set up the motor crane on the GX. Uh, super excited. It should be pretty easy and straightforward with the Sherpa rack and uh, yeah, so I'll take you along for the journey. All right, so we got the base of the turret on and uh, everything's looking super secure. It all went pretty smoothly. We just got a few more uh, things to put on. Obviously the uh, crane itself and then the huge motor. That'll be interesting to get it up there, but making progress.
All right, so we got the crane all on. Everything's working. It's definitely tied well into the... Uh... It's tied well into the uh, Sherpa roof rack, which goes like directly into the metal frame of the roof. And yeah, it's nice, actually handy having this Nash Fabco ladder too, to like install everything. Yeah, literally just fucking... Look at that. Yeah. Yeah, like you should, yeah, standing on the speed rail. I wouldn't stand on the turret maybe, but <laughs> I'm not putting weight on it. Okay. <laughs> so we measured, it's, uh, it yeah, it's yeah. 10 and a half feet at the top of the fairing on the back. So definitely got to watch out if, mm -hmm. you know, read the, uh, the labels on the short bridges and stuff and off-road like any trees and safety is definitely paramount. It's number one. Putting the motor crane was a success on the GX. Uh, we have a shoot coming up in about a week or so uh, that we'll be filming with the GX and the motor crane. Uh, thanks for watching, and we'll catch you in the next one. Peace.